Welcome to Northwoods Angling. We got a pretty special night tonight. We got uh, a couple guests here that you guys have never met. I've never met. This is Pete from another fishing show. What's up everybody? And the one, the only, one of the, the best muskie anglers, I would say, in the world. Well, there you go. Mr. Pete Mena. So we're out on the ice. We're fishing for sturgeon. We got another shack back here with another surprise guest that we're gonna show you later on. Who'd you bring with you? Well, I brought my sidekick, if you will. Hey! Greg Underdahl, working hey. behind the camera. Greg's on the I'm camera. I'm blocking Pete. I don't want to block Pete. I got to go back. <laughs> it's tough being Pete number two tonight, but so far so good. I'm hanging yep. in there. You know, I'm used to being number one, but... <laughs> but yeah, so, so far we've just seen uh, a tick here and a tick there, but nothing. Yep. It's going to be a great night. I'm feeling good so far. I mean, I have nothing but optimism, so uh, Very yeah. Very good. Yeah, let's rip this stuff up, huh? I'm feeling it. I'm watching. Oh, we lost a strike indicator here, guys. What's oh. Greg? When he was moving around, look what he did. <laughs> Amateur night. Yeah. So, so we're doing the same thing in regards to our strike indicators on our snowmen. Swinging into the hole, we pop the bobber off and set the hook. And we are still waiting for Blake to show up, who had parent-teacher conferences tonight. Yep, Blake set oh. us up in the house, got everything oh, drilled here. out for us. Yeah, good man. We good like man. Blake. So he set everything up. We just kind of walked in to his setups, and now we're going to see if we can make him count. So it's all about concentration at this point, right? You know what else he's bringing? <laughs> he's bringing pizza. That's right. Oh. <laughs> it's a beautiful there he is. day in this world. A hero. <laughs> Pizza. <laughs> hey. It's like the episode of Mr. Rogers' Neighborhood. I'm going to show up, take off my coat, sit down, take a seat, hey. your hand. Nice How to are meet you, you, man? Yeah. Good. I'm very good. Life is good tonight. Life is good tonight, and it just got better. I assume PEP indicates we have ourselves a pepperoni oh, pizza. Oh, I thought it said uh -huh. Pete on it, and I was nope. ready to arm wrestle Pete Mana for it. Nope. Good Lord. So this is what a Woody's pizza looks like? 12 inches Booyah. of pizza perfection. <laughs> you don't mind if I grab a chunk, do you? It's all yours. This is ice Not fishing. This is ice fishing, folks. Oh! And the rattle thing. <laughs> hey! hey. With oh. the rattle thing down, huh? <laughs> the fish rattle. on, fish, fish on. on! What are you thinking, Pete? I like it. I like it. It's a big fish. Get that bobber out of the hole. Okay. All right, so, like you said, we don't have safety goggles, so keep yeah, the head no, off to the, the side. Is this the part where the shrapnel starts to fly? There he is. Yep. It's the right species. It's not a 90 pounder. It's not. Hey! But it ate it. But my first sturgeon through the ice. Here we go. Huh? Here we go. <laughs> Gotta be something to be said for that. Yeah. <laughs> Here you go, buddy. Very cool. Oh, you're such a cutie. Oh, it's got something to say to you. Talking to me, too. Well, you heard the bait talking to him down there. Look at that. Yeah, yeah. Oh, smile. Pete Mena's first targeted ice lake sturgeon, St. Croix River. You know what? He might be a little big for a quick strike rig, but. <laughs> well, very cool guys with That's one yeah. so that I'll may have that. been contributed that fish its bait was in the center hole two feet away was this attractant machine <laughs> with with artificial uh lump oh, lotion yeah, stuck onto it don't forget that so as we watch the strike indicators here, hoping for one to go down. Now I told you about the sound maker, but Blake is not aware. Do you think these sturgeon, they have to hear sound, feel it like Absolutely. any other Absolutely. So Livingston Lures, who I work with, developing a predator line of baits, but they've got, their lures have a sound maker in every single one and a battery system. They got this new thing they're testing called a chummer which basically is different bait fish sounds, but it's 10 times louder than the ones they put in the lures. I like and where you're going with this. I have some along and- I Why thought, aren't they in the water? Well, I, you got, we got here talking, they were throwing pizza around and you know. No, it's time. So here we got, uh, let's see, I don't. 
We right? better put it under the water because I don't want to listen to it. Well, that's yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's a woodpecker on this. I know. Yeah. If you turn it up, yeah, yeah. This woodpecker is a woodpecker you want to shoot. <laughs> now, now this is a shrimp, actually. Now hold on, let's let's shut the shrimp off. It sounds just like a shrimp too. I always say that. Now there's a pinfish. I like shrimp more than pinfish at this point. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's what they all say. But we can actually try this. Got to seal it up. You got to turn it on at this stage. Yeah, clip it on the line and send it down. But we should maybe put it outside of the tent just in case we get a fish on. But I mean, it's something I thought of trying for well, let's we'll, turn it we'll, on. Good Lord. We'll sacrifice one of the lures and we'll clip that onto the split ring and we'll just drop one down off to the side for a little bit and see if we put the grab the light up. That's what's going on. We have this gigantic thing connected to this gigantic <laughs> thing connected to the sturgeon thing with the hook thing. So we have the ability to Careful now, don't get it tangled. Ooh, we look have at that. the ability to catch a fish at the top and attract them at the bottom. This is a finesse technique. And what this thing is supposed to do is induce a feeding frenzy. Now, we're not just gonna stop there. Oh! We're going to up the ante and add kind of a scent attractant to it. Real meat, allure, and and it's gonna it's all gonna break loose it all culminates to this one point in time and you guys all get to witness it gonna what's gonna happen is that's gonna hit the bottom and you're gonna want to hold on Don't so forget that it didn't not like this um so oh, it came right in it did it came right in pete seen it triggered the bobber popped the bobber off he set the hook <laughs> and we yielded results, Pete. All right, well, go down there and tell your friends. Grandpa, tell Grandpa to come yeah. over and pay us a visit. Oh, no, 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 you're heading the wrong way now. Come on. There we go, head first. Nicely done. <laughs> Excellent work. <laughs> down to the bottom. Uh, We're ahead of that shack now. Uh, one to are? one, but theirs was that big and ours was that big. <laughs> High five, buddy. <laughs> the attractant's going right back down. Yeah. That, that, Get that, yeah, absolutely. It did not hinder at all. You know, looking at that thing, you wouldn't think that maybe would bring in fish, but it seems like it, it's doing the It trip. didn't scare him away. <laughs> and I'll tell you what, we saw a mark right above it right away and then kind of went. I wonder if that fish was sitting there looking at it that long and then finally came over and grabbed this bait. It was probably trying to nibble the worms and minnows off the... <laughs> right, the rest is history. And how about Sam? You have some incredible sprinting speed to get from that house. Did you just come Absolutely. out of the... Were you standing in between the two houses? Oh yeah, I train. I train. I, I put this right here. I just talk and I go. I'm talking 50-yard gaps right here. Book three. I, didn't, I didn't want to mess up the shot, so I just got in here and I just... That was like, like Olympic could. speed. Dude. I was like, Pete's hooked up. I gotta go. You I are go. fast. That was awesome. That was awesome. Look at all the people in this tent. I love it. <laughs> There's still half as many as there was. <laughs> Only a couple weeks left on the season. <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> just about turned to you and say you didn't really break it, you just kind of bent it. I still get a plug out of that. <laughs> yes! Hey, thanks for joining us on Northwoods Angling tonight. Fishing wasn't the best, but it for me, I know it was a whirlwind of emotions. Pete Mayna <laughs> on the ice, first sturgeon ever. How did it feel? It was great. The sturgeon was great, and it was wonderful being in confined places with all of you folks. I mean, wait, careful now. Oh, sorry, careful sorry, now. Sorry. <laughs> Thanks, hey, Lion Pete. Yeah. Hey, guys, check out Pete's YouTube channel, Pete Mayna, professional musky fisherman, and obviously another fishing show. Go subscribe to them on YouTube. Great guys. Great guys to fish Aww. with. We love you guys. Yeah. Oh, yeah. We love you and uh, you'll be seeing more from us in the future. So thanks again.